Hello everyone, we are back with Glen Dover Reviews here, and I just got my TDS meter for my um, RO system to see the, you know, the readout of the um, incoming water compared to the out outgoing water. And this way we could see how good of a job the filter is doing and how much it's filtering out all the, um, you know, minerals and deposits and all that other stuff out of the water so this is pretty much what we got i went with this i found it on amazon it's right here it's called an hm digital right here hm digital as you could see dual inline um tds monitor is what it's called so let's open this up and see what we got it comes with fittings which is great so we got the instruction manual right here user guide how to install it all that other crap um i don't think it should be that hard to install it but if you need to read them then you know you're gonna have to read yours obviously i think that it's pretty simple on how you got to install this so it does come with t's which is pretty cool so it comes with these t's right here and all you're gonna do is put it in line when you when you're gonna put it in this T right on the top right here and you're going to put it in line with the water going in and then coming out of your RO unit. It's pretty simple. They give you two fittings. Hopefully they don't leak. Let's check when we uh, when we install this and you guys check it out later in the video or you know next video whatever. Um, we're going to check it out and we'll, hopefully these don't leak. I don't see any clips. These don't come with clips as the other ones did where <clears throat> after you secure it you put a clip in here and it makes sure it's nice and secure. So I do not see any clips with this setup, just to tell you. <clears throat> so it says water quality monitor, <coughs> dual inline TDS meter, I mean monitor. Spot track your water filtration. No one, a reverse osmosis system needs servicing. The perfect monitor for water purification systems. That's what it's saying. This is everything it does so you guys can see it close up. All right, you can pause that, and then you can read that if you want to read that. All right, so that's all about that. And here's what the meter looks like close up. It's pretty cool. Um, left or right, in or out, I mean, uh, in or out of the water, and then the on or off button right there. Uh, there's no point of turning it on right now. It's not really going to work if I turn it on because it's not um, hooked up. But here's the in and out right here. I'm not sure what, oh, it even tells you. Never mind. Out is blue, and in in is red so they tell you what it is in is red out is blue so it comes with this little harness over here i guess and that's how it detects the um total uh whatever it is i don't even know what that total uh dissolved solvents inside the water i think that's what it stands for total dissolved solvents and that's going to show you the water quality so we're going to check out uh, how this works. We're going to install it and you guys are going to see how my water quality is. This comes with um, Velcro on the back so you could stick it to somewhere if you want to stick it somewhere and hang it up. It's pretty cool. Uh, we'll see how that's going to look. But this is a good option and a cheap option. I only paid $15 for it. Maybe $20. I'm not sure. Something like that. And this is going to tell me my water quality of my filtration system and the water quality of North New Jersey water. So that's pretty much what, how that's going to help me out. You want to make sure you position these the right way, just to let you know. I read that in the manual already, that you have to make sure those are positioned the right way. Otherwise, this meter is not going to work, and it's going to be garbage for you. So make sure you read the instructions thoroughly how to install these and then you'll have a great working meter and I'm not sure about the maintenance on how to take care of it yet I didn't read that but just um, how to get a good reading um, I you know looked it up and it said that this has to be in a certain position and so does this one in order to give you that reading okay so that's it for a review of an unboxing pretty much review of it so you guys can see and we'll check it out on my filtration system in the next video Oh, and um, and we'll see what that looks like, and we'll see uh, my water quality in North New Jersey. All right. Thank you, everybody, for watching Glen Velvet Reviews. I am out. Have a good one. Be safe. If you have any questions or comments, always post them down below. I would love to know. And please subscribe to my channel and join me on my review adventure of everything else I like to review. All right. Have a good one. Bye, bye, everybody.